up the hill into six here. Whoa. A little wiggle. Maybe a little hill. Yeah, that's what I was thinking too. Menard. Oh, there's one around. Uh, Scott in the 11 car back at turn six. Oh, oh big boy. Rick. Oh, oh my grab one, one, two, three, it's four, out. five, six, seven, eight cars piled up at turn number six. Uh, Colin Brown is uh, involved in the 16 after staying on the lead lap. This is just what Carl Edwards wanted, though. I mean, this caution flag is going to let him make it. Well, it's not just Carl. It's all those leaders that pitted there. Uh, I don't think any of them could actually make it if it went green, which uh, doesn't look like there's any chance of that now as we start getting down towards the end. A little more take than give. Well, Boy, I tell you, the 59 Ooh. car is just clobbered of Kyle Kelly right there. That's Tony Raines. I counted eight of them. Oh, there's one I hadn't counted. 09 car. See water and oil pouring out of the 09 yeah, car. It's Rob Brent. All right, starts around the 11 car. Brian Scott there. You see, they're all two by two. And, oh, Whoa, man, boy. Tony Raines just gets jacked up. And it's just a blind corner. Once you get top of this hill, guys, as you're going up the hill, you don't see anything. And if there's something wrong at the other end, you just plow into it. And we just saw that. And it's all part of understanding this track, where to place your spotters to help you, things like that. Now, and watch this piling in here. Bang, 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 bang. Stan Baird going through the gravel. Colin Brown's view. Oh, oh, he didn't see it developing. Colin Brown gets off in the gravel trap in turn one, gets out of that deal without going a lap down, and loses it all right here. Two words. Big mess. Bad luck. That is turn number six, and uh, the cleanup there is going to take a minute. And so now what we're going to see among the front runners is, like we were talking about before, Andy, is uh, shutting it off and saving fuel. Oh, they started... Uh, crew chief started telling drivers to start saving fuel the second that caution came out. You'll see him put it in neutral, turn the switch off, coast as much as possible. You know, it seems like every single road race we go to, we see, we see the same thing. Everybody shutting the engines off, trying to save fuel, gambling an awful lot that there's going to be a lot of caution flags so they can keep that track position, so they can make it to the end. Much more gambling than you see on an oval track.